Hello everyone. My name is Queen Blessing Biggest and popularly known as Black Queen. Um, this afternoon I'm making this video because um, a lady contacted me and um, she was bothered about her husband and she wanted my advice on what to do. Here's what she said. She said that um, she's been married to her husband for a couple of years now. They have five children and um, the man is a soldier. So he has been transferred to Meduguri while they live here in Lagos. And so because of the distance, they don't they hardly see each other. So the man comes uh, maybe during December and then she visits the man when the kids are gone to school because um, I think three of them are in boarding school already. So it's kind of less work for her. Uh, but the problem is she believes the man is cheating on her and then and i asked her what makes her think the man is cheating he said because the man does not talk to her the way they used to talk number one then number two that when she uh, tries to call the man the man does not pick the man calls only when he feels like calling and then when they when they get to talk they talk only about family they never talk about their their love life their romance or whatever and i said to her is that enough reason for you to just conclude that your husband is cheating did you see any woman with him he said um, no that um, she didn't really see a woman face to face but sometimes when they do video calls that's like there's a woman living in the house that the husband is renting in Meduguri and I told her I said madam um, you want me to advise you to divorce your husband because you think he is cheating uh, according to her she now cut me short and said no that's not what she wants me to say she wants me to advise her because um, the man each time she accused the man of cheating the man always say um, I can marry I'm an African man I can marry as many wives as I want and I told her I said see the truth of the matter is the man has told you the truth he's an African he can decide to marry more than one wife if he wants to and again if the man is truly not cheating on you and you keep accusing him of cheating he might decide to cuckoo just marry another wife so that you will stop accusing him of cheating and number two is that the kind of profession the man is in is a soldier man what do you expect that he's going to just be with his phone playing with it playing games all the time it's probably he's busy and then of course he will call you when it's convenient for him because he knows when it's convenient and then i asked her i said are you doing anything because sometimes when women are not working they tend to be so free and the, the, the next thing they try to do with their freedom is to get their husband to call them every second. You understand? And, you know, she then said she has a business, she's running, and all of that, and all of that. I said, okay, fine. If you're running a business, rather than make yourself sad and make yourself unhappy, why don't you focus your energy on your business? Focus your energy on your children. Focus on things that makes you happy. Take your mind away from your husband being a cheat or cheating for a while and see how happy you're going to get. Happiness is truly free and not expensive. You decide what you want your life to be. Trust me. Some women just give themselves unnecessary problems. And I asked her, I said, see, does this man take care of the children? Does he pay the fees? Does he take care of the house bills? And they say, yes. I said, what is the problem? Have you ever seen a woman there when you go there? She said, no. I said, then so why are you looking for problem when there is none? She said, because the man is not romantic enough. And I said to her, the best thing is to make yourself happy in your own way. Focus on your children, focus on your business. Because if I advise you to get a divorce just because you think a man is cheating or just because he's no, he's, he's the distance, truly, truth be told, there is no way your relationship can be the same if the man is very distant, especially when you guys started and you people were all together, it was never a distant relationship from beginning. So you cannot expect it to be the same. But if it was a distant relationship from beginning, then everybody understands that he calls me when he can, I call when I can. And so everybody is already in the know of what happens. But when the relationship started, like, you know, we're always together and all that, and then it now becomes a distant relationship, then children and get involved. One thing people need to understand, as soon as children get into a relationship, that distance even when you are living together you know comes because there are times you want to spend time with your children there are times the man wants to spend time with you and you are not available there are times um, you want to spend time with the man the man is also not available then you channel your energy to your children that's what i always advise women 
it gets to a point where that relationship can never be the bam 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 as it used to be when you guys just started rather than looking for trouble looking for things to make you have hypertension trust me when you start taking drugs for high bp you never stop you take it for life why would you want to put yourself in such situation i know it's not easy there are times where you you want to do all the lovey dovey all the hello honey the sweet there are no when, when the man is maybe he's thinking okay now the children are growing the responsibility has grown so much that he's thinking of oh which university my child will go to you know how will i save enough money how will i do it so the pressure is be become so much that even the lovey dovey and all is no longer there it's a, it's, it's an idle mind that think of you know all the calling all the time trust me people that are very busy hardly get to spend time like that with their wives or, or husbands because their mind is just there how to make business work so i told her i said see what you can do is since your kids are now in boarding school visit him often Medukri is not too far from Lagos. By the time you spend two days on the road, you will get there. And if you want to take a flight, you cut your journey. You understand? By the time you fly into Kanu and continue your journey from there, 24 hours, you will get there. Spend two weeks with your husband. Come back. But a man that will cheat, if you like, spend 20, 68 days with him. 1368 days with him. By the time you just leave, another woman will come there. Why give yourself a headache? A man that will not cheat on you, even if he doesn't see you for three years, you will meet him the way you left him. A man that will cheat you, even if you just leave his house, as you are getting out of his gate, another woman that is coming to look for him will cross you at the gate. It's not enough to give yourself pressure when a man is doing his duty in taking care of you and your children. My dear, focus your energy that you want to use in doing jealousy. Pocket it. Focus your business. Don't go and get hypertension for nothing. Because you might be thinking he's cheating and he is not. For instance, the woman is talking about it. She even told me that after talking to her, that her mind is down. She, I told her, I said, see, I am here to help whoever needs my help in all these relationship matters. I am not the best when it comes to relationship. All my, my own relationship too has its own challenges. But I'm saying that there are challenges in relationships that you cannot overlook. But there are some challenges that we create on our own. And I told her, don't look for what is not lost. Because your relationship, your marriage is still intact. As far as I'm concerned, focus on your children. Make yourself happy. Just put on music. Dance. You know, anytime the devil is bringing, oh, hey, your husband might be with a woman now. Tell the devil, yes, let him be with a woman. You will see that by the time you do that to the devil two times, you stop thinking about that. You know, so that was my advice to her. Guys, watch this video, share it. Let people that are having similar problems and not being able to come out to talk about it, watch this video and solve their problems. If you think I was right, say it. Just place it in the comment below. And if you think I was wrong, still give her your advice. She, she's been following me for years, so she's going to see your uh, whatever advice you decide to give. So guys, thank you so much for always helping me solve cases. And some cases when I solve them, I like to use them to teach. And that's why I'm making this video. Alright? So guys, um, you can follow me on Instagram on queen underscore blessing underscore the biggest thing. And keep following the real queen blessing, the biggest thing page. And of course, my movies are still on YouTube for you to watch. Adakeja is still on YouTube. Um, Ifeo Tito is still on YouTube. Aging Love is on YouTube. Fix It or Kill It is also a relationship film. It's on YouTube. Go watch and tell me what you think. Thank you guys. I love you so much.